Applications open today for the second round of federal assistance loans for those small businesses. Of course, this comes with so many frustrations mm. right now, so understandable. The program received criticism at the time for granting loans to big corporations over our small businesses. Now many mom and pop shops are, are hopeful to get their chance as those loopholes are supposed to be closed. CBS 17's Bridget Chapman is live in Raleigh after finding out how big of a difference it can make for them. Bridget. Guys, it's hard to find businesses in our area that have not been impacted by COVID-19. And many stores like the ones in this shopping center here, even though their doors have been closed for weeks, they're still paying their rent, their employees, and utilities. Businesses across the triangle are reeling from the impact of COVID-19. It can be really overwhelming for a small business owner. Many experiencing a substantial loss in profits. Lost 80% of our income. We're about 30% down of where we were at last year. Others are closing altogether. The Paycheck Protection Program is one of the federal government's efforts to help small businesses during these times. Wake County business owner Chuck Norman says his company, SNA Communications, received money from the first round of PPP loans. What it did was bought us an extra five weeks or so of time to be able to see what the long term picture looks like. He was happy to hear the government decided to do a second round of loans. I think it's great because so many people that really needed it didn't have uh, the ability to even be considered the first time around. Andy Ellen, president of the North Carolina Retail Merchants Association, says retail accounts for one of four jobs in the state. He says these loans can determine whether or not businesses stay open. It's been tough for them to. To, to you know, continue to weather this storm and watch week after week not being able to open and they're sitting on inventory in some cases. Ellen says he knows they'll reopen safely at some point and hopes shoppers will help make up for lost time. These businesses are so much the, the fabric of their community and we hope when all this is over that the customers will go out and support those businesses. Experts say they think that this second round of loans are going to go fast because so many banks already had applications ready to go. And it takes about anywhere from a few days to a few weeks to actually get that money. Live in Raleigh, Bridget Chapman, CBS 17 News.